Hello nutcases and welcome back to my 50th uh, subscriber celebration, which is me games from my childhood. There will be a lot of games. It's a like wallet this. that belongs to I wonder what would keep that clam from snapping shut. Blenny is depending on us to find one more golden pipe. I wonder if Gil Barker stole the great conch shell. Are you trying to bribe the world famous Gil Barker? Well, I'll tell you, you guppies won't be getting the best of me. No, ma'am, you won't. Freddy, maybe we should hold on to the wallet ourselves. We'll find the owner, Luther. You'll see. Did you lose a wallet? I don't think so. Well, I guess it's ours then. Luther! It's a wallet that be- Is that the wallet of Pierre in your fin? Yes, sir. Ah, my beautiful, one-of-a-kind wallet. Here's something from the great Pierre just for you. Just one orange urchin? Luther, don't be greedy. Thank you, Pierre. phrase book for one orange sea urchin, Sam. I'd rather get a snack, but an orange sea urchin will do. Thanks a lot, Sam. We'll put this to good use. Not fun. Anyway, 
Ready, I can't understand a word that foreign tourist is saying. Ready, I can't understand a word that understand a word that foreign tourist is saying. Maybe we can find the language he's speaking in this foreign language phrase book. <laughs> May we please have the Shim Sham Jimmy Jam Clapper Gapper that's in your bag? Gosh, that can't be the right flag. He didn't understand the word I said. Have the Shim Sham Jimmy Jam Clapper Gapper that's in your bag. I have a funny feeling that this is not the correct flag. May we please have the Shim Sham Jimmy Jam Clapper Gapper that's in your bag? I guess that wasn't his language. May we please have the Shim Sham Jimmy Jam Clapper Gapper that's in your bag? I guess that wasn't his language. May we please have the Shim Sham Jimmy Jam Clapper Gapper that's in your bag? We'll have to find the right flag before we can talk to each other. That one sure wasn't it. Mr. Tourist, sir. I think we're going to have to figure out how we can talk to each other. Gapper that's in your bag. Oh, yeah. So the Shim Sham Jimity Jam Clapper Gapper that's been giving horse feathers so much trouble is what you want? I'd be glad to give you to it. Thank you, Mr. Feather, sir.
Back to the clamshell. A shim sham jimmy jam clapper gapper will keep that clam from snapping shut. Okay, Luther, I'm gonna need your help. Right oh, Freddy! <laughs> Yikes! Hello? I got a golden pipe! I don't care what anyone else says, you're a good fish. Wait! We found all three golden pipes! Come on! Let's see if old Soggy can pick up the bad guy's scent. Here you go, boy! Come on, Luther! We've got a bad guy to catch! you out so you can put the jewel back and we can catch that thief. <laughs> Old Soggy, you go on ahead and track that shell thief. We'll meet you back at the center of town as soon as we can. <laughs> Gorgeous shade of red. I hope this doesn't set off another trap. But I've got to try everything to get Luther out. Uh, 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 uh. This red crystal could really come in handy if I could only break it loose. Beautiful blue. Uh, oh, uh, phew, this blue crystal could really come in handy. If only I could break it loose. A 
chisel could loosen that crystal. This beautiful red crystal sure gives off a lot of light. That could come in very handy indeed. Hey, the crystal grew back. Wow, look at the light from this blue crystal. could come in handy. gives off a lot of green light. That might come in very handy. I need to get Luther out. Right? Nothing in this place is as easy as it looks. I have an idea. Drop this bag. <gasps> Looks like we can solve this case. Come on. Pasha, if Pierre was in charge, this would never have happened. It's unbelievable. The letdown of a lifetime. This is more disappointing than when the Plankton Circus came to town. It's all Uncle Blenny's fault. I'm gonna give that bum a piece of my mind. Please help me! Stop! Uncle Blenny is innocent! <gasps> the thief dropped this bag. When we looked inside, we found a visitor's map, which means the thief is... Horst? Horst Feathers, you're the thief. That map of a visitor belong could to anybody. You have on me nothing. Oh, no? 
Okay. Maybe something on me you do have. Confess, I must. I thought would not it make a great souvenir. Also make a great hearing aid for my old silver-haired granny. I no idea had it was so valuable. It doesn't matter whether the conch is valuable or not. You should never take things that don't belong to you. And I'm sure your old silver-haired granny would agree with me. Forgive, please, my action. Horst is most sorry I return you to the great conch. Uncle Blenny, we're sorry we blamed you. That's okay. I'm still the grand exalted keeper of the conch. Thanks to Freddy and Luther. <laughs> and old Sabu. Gosh, what can I ever do to thank you? Just do your duty, oh grand exalted keeper of the conch. Because he stole the great conch for his granny, Horst was convicted on a 525 granny larceny. As punishment, Horst was sentenced to write a new foreign language phrase book that wasn't nearly as silly as the one he had on this trip. Case closed.
Thank you.